Star Citizen seems to be one of those games that really stokes a strong emotional response. Love it or hate it. Certainly, it's attracted a fair share of controversy over the years, yet this game has raised hundreds of millions in crowdfunding and has an incredibly passionate, often borderline zealous, fanbase. I'm Farrister, and in this video we'll explore some of the reasons why players love this game so much. It's worth clarifying, Star Citizen is currently in alpha testing, has been for a while, perhaps controversially could be for a while, so some of this is subject to change. The first reason many players love this game is quite obvious when loading up for the first time. It's the incredible graphics. Star Citizen really pushes the boundaries of graphical fidelity, whether you're out in the void of space or on one of the many planets or moons. With a considerable number of highly detailed assets imported into Amazon's Lumberyard engine, this is where Star Citizen really shines. And it's all made possible by the second reason that players love Star Citizen. And that's the fact that you, as the player, are truly the centre of your version of this universe. The whole game is built up from a first person perspective. So, unlike other games, you don't play as your spaceship. If you want to fly it, you go sit in the pilot's chair and you see whatever your character sees from that position. All of that builds into the graphical immersion and sense of scale because it's you looking out of the window from truly your character's eyes. It also means you can be on a ship with your friends, watch them walking around, see the same things that they see. And so many players love Star Citizen for the escapism that it offers. If you're enjoying this video, please press that like button and of course subscribe if you'd like to be notified of future Star Citizen videos. The third reason players love Star Citizen, and that's the vision, the scope, the size of the game. Star Citizen is often criticised for being a long time in development, with many critics pointing out that a game of this size could always be in an unfinished state. But that's in part because Star Citizen is unashamedly bold in setting goals, and truly groundbreaking in many aspects. To have a single, living, breathing universe with everything from the smallest snub fighter or ground rover to the largest capital ships with all of the gameplay in between, ranging from mining, trading, ship combat, ground combat, repair, medical, I could go on. That's what has truly captivated the imagination of many backers, who hope to see that become a reality. And also leads into the fourth reason that players love Star Citizen, and that's the sandbox gameplay. In the current iteration, many of the aforementioned features are either not yet complete, or not even in-game at all, and yet many players log into the alpha game to play. And that's because of the fact that Star Citizen offers a graphically immersive sandbox. Personally, I hate to use the phrase emergent gameplay, as it always feels like a cop-out for something that isn't included that should be. That said, Star Citizen's persistent universe is a social simulator. It's a great place to meet up with friends and do pretty much whatever. Certainly, being in an active organisation can be a real plus, with friends to enjoy the game with. And if you'd like to join such a group, I've included details in the video description for my organisation. Which all builds up to the final reason that many players are so passionate about Star Citizen, and that's the community. This can be a bit of a double-edged sword, with sometimes passion overstepping the line into zealotry, but undeniably, the hundreds of millions raised in crowdfunding by Star Citizen is due to the overwhelming support and optimism of a huge community. And that can be a really positive community at times, encouraging each other or helping each other out in-game. Let me know in the comments your reasons for loving Star Citizen, or not, as the case may be. And if you've enjoyed this video, you may also be interested in my Star Citizen Location Spotlight series. Please also subscribe if you'd like to see future Star Citizen content. It helps you to be notified of future videos and helps me to grow the audience. And as always, thank you for watching.